Hi, my name is Ali Paz from the Yoga Home. Welcome to my new channel. I'm so excited to share with you all the tools and techniques I've actually learned from the past 17 years when I started this journey with yoga and meditation. So today in this video, we'll be doing a breathing technique called Nadi Shodhana. But before you go anywhere, or before we start, if you have not subscribed yet or press that bell button next to it, you'll get notified every week. I'm going to post one on every Monday. And of course, if you are inspired by this video, please feel free to share it. Okay, let's get going with this breathing technique. So pranayama basically means prana is like this extension. So you're, you're really being mindful of where the breath is going. Sometimes we have different ratio counts to it. Um, and then there's also a retention and a holding of the breath. So at any point, if you retain and hold the breath and feel anxiety or anything. I don't want you to feel that. So just in this one, don't retain or hold the breath, but this is the ratio that I use. So it's inhaling and I'll show you the mudra of all the, the hands and everything in a second. But when you inhale on one side of the nostril, you're counting to six. Okay. And then you'll retain and hold the breath for four, four counts. And like I said, if that it brings anxiety to you or you're pregnant, I would advise you not to hold the breath. Then exhale for eight. So go really slow, okay, as you exhale. And then that's coming from one nostril to the other side. And then now back up the other side of the nostril for six counts, four to hold, and then eight to exhale. And that's one full round. When you go up, hold, down, up, hold, down. So until you end in your right side or your left side, depending on when you start. Okay, so now the hand position. This is Nadi Shodhana. Nadis are the energetic channels in the body. So basically we're, we're cleansing out these channels. If you're familiar with Chinese medicine, it's, it's the chi that runs through the meridians, okay? So they're kind of like meridians. Shodhana just means cleansing and purifying. Okay, so you're using your right hand, dropping first finger and middle finger. Now, if that's difficult for you to do, just go back and forth, thumb to first finger. Okay, some people do this and go back and forth, but I usually tuck mine down. Okay, the palm faces the right hand, palm faces your face. The left can be in Gyan Mudra, Gyan Mudra, Wisdom Mudra, so first finger and thumb. Just placing it on top of your knee palm facing upwards. Okay, so you would begin by exhaling through both nostrils. You can close the eyes and relax and do this with me. So before we start doing it together, I just want you to see the positioning. So I'll explain once again, the thumb is open. So inhaling through the right side for six. I'm just going to go through this really quick, holding for four and then exhaling down the left side for eight. Okay, and then inhale six, hold for four, exhale eight. So that's one full round. So you're just going back and forth with the thumb and the ring finger. Okay, let's do it together. Try it out. Sit tall, exhale through both nostrils, covering the left side as you inhale through the right. For six, and then plug both sides, hold for four, three, two, one, exhale, left side, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, left side, one, two, three, four, five, six. Hold for four, three, two, one. Exhale, right side, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. So that's one full round. You can change the ratios if you want. Make the inhale longer, or the exhale shorter, or whatever suits your body. Okay, so that's just the technique to get you going to calm the mind. It balances out the right and left hemispheres of the brain, calms the nervous system, decreases that stress and cortisol level. So many benefits to this practice. Um, so let me know how it goes in the comments below. Namaste.